Here's a short video. I just um, did out the lemongrass. So if I can, I will pick in the middle so it leaves room for it to split again. I did this twice a year. Um, as you can see, I thin out inside a little bit. Then I put fertilizer or just soil on top and now I will water it. Um, this is the one I already thinned it out. And I'll show you this one. I haven't thinned it out yet. As you can see, once you thin it out, the root getting big. Um, the stem is big and healthy. You see? The stem is very big and healthy. So if you have time, you remove this um, dead leaf. But if you don't, it's fine. Um, but this is how I thin it out. And when you harvest, you use a knife, you cut down. You use a knife right here, and you cut down to the root outside and you break it. That way you remove the root as well, and then the other root would have room to split. Um, you don't just cut it on top. You could, but um, when it grow back up, it's not as healthy. Um, when you remove the whole stem with root, you cut two inches from the root up to two inch you consume the rest of it this root you put it back down and you space it out two inches and then it would just split again this is um keep growing and consuming and then it keep growing you don't leave it just overgrown um every two two months or so depend in summer every three weeks I would trim the leaf, the leaf and make it this length only. It look nice as a landscape and it look healthy. But if you leave it overgrown, um, it would just feed the leaf instead of the root. So keep it at that length. The root is very healthy and big. As you can see. You see, the stem is bigger than my finger. Um, this is ready to harvest some, but I still need time to uh, thin out the other one. Complete thinning out one first before I consume this and thin this out. But you see, I will remove all of this dead leaf. Leave room for it to split.